Fala galera, tranquilo? Estou aqui no início do vídeo para convidar todos vocês para participar da nossa comunidade Aleartes, um grupo relacionado especialmente para CSGO. Vamos trocar bastante ideia sobre o jogo, sorteios, lobbies, mix com a galera e outras novidades exclusivas para todos que estiveram no grupo. Então não perde tempo, é de graça e infelizmente as vagas são limitadas. Link vai estar na descrição do vídeo, basta descer a tela aí e entrar, fechou? Vejo todos vocês lá, é nóis guys! like a last second replacement you know you always have a backup fighter mm -hmm. and it's not supposed to be a favorite at all that's this the other eg couldn't make it let's watch this eg duke it out in their place poor walco first down art just awaits the commitment there's no short play coming out from eg very much fixated on the upper ramp yuri's gonna take a gush Bolsters the confidence of the push. Russian Junior with a headshot apiece. And EG staring down the barrel of a pistol round win. Bomb plants there for the taking. Still low HP on the guy standing boost. But drop starts to even things out. And drop's gonna connect with another headshot. Leaving this one on Junior and Hexed. No smokes will actually have to go for kills. They'll tap the bomb, but that gets spotted immediately. They fall back. Haven't spotted sandbags just yet. Yuri with low health. It's hexed from the sandbags. Shots from the left side. Doesn't need to fight him. Yuri's low health, but he's getting pinched. That's the favorable fight. And now hexed into the 1v1. Just also burning time. Dies to safe, but time decides. And for Rush, I know what he's saying when he says it's like it was like a relief to play against a team like Imperial, even if I think he kind of implied that they lost. Just because it's just more fun to uh, play against teams that are like so much better than you to learn faster. But this is, you know, getting thrown to the Lions for sure. Yeah, and Lions don't show much mercy. Art will fall to Rush. Double kill recovery here as they work their way back up ramp. Remember, this was lesser guns for Furia, but pretty confident in just gunning down the ramp, getting the kills they wanted. Safe runs the risk of extending out from elevator. And because those other players aren't as well equipped, still life on this for EG. Junior's gonna jump him on the reload. No coverage from the elevator player. Safe, gonna connect. Very clean scout headshot. But now major champion rush will tuck into the short side. Caserado, his next victim. Oh, Mac 10 wow. immediately to the forehead. Oof. But George gets stuffed by Caserato's aggression. And it's one thing for this EG to play versus other top tier teams, but you're playing versus Furia, who may just jump at the chance to pummel you with aggression. Art fighting for the bottom of the ramp, wins out versus Walco. He's getting bullied now, one and five. Hex does get out mid yet again. CT's not gonna respect that elevator smoke, so Hex will be caught off guard. And now again, Furia back to winning ways. Yeah, that one's a little poofy. So Yuri can safely get out of that smoke blind and not have to worry about someone close to him. Now they're guessing a little bit, you know, as to what to do next. So they start to get peeled apart. This will be hard to figure out. So, well, Rush goes down next. Junior up to the plate. And, you know, what we want this game is a big junior round. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. Yep. Because, like, again, win or lose, three map series throughout the last however many months junior has had good maps like barely any bad maps in series even one ct sticks around and drop within sight yuri's not too far away and safe finds that mid climb from hex he was hoping to get over construction drop unfortunately for eg he's gonna tear away their hopes and dreams if only they had found him then bomb could have gone down instead after time this could hurt they're given a chance to oh, save smoke Oh, that's rough for EG. The junior catches Yuri, and Art dies with just the one. Now, pistols can grab those weapons, try to transition into the commitment. It's going to be safe first, drop behind him. Off shot, clean, but rush with the return. Now, bomb can't be planted because of the... And we're talking. Peeks out, does a bit of damage. It's George to make the difference oh, off the of Galil. Bad. And drop, yeah, even so though he's got that... Art gets a little bit too much, but drop's about to join him. They get yeah, both. That's actually 
Yeah, people don't really do those that a ramp setup anymore. I feel like Furia were just giving it a shot. Um, but they're also keeping options open here. Bomb is walking back the other way as they throw some utility, and they're hoping for the reclear of ramp. And Furia, well, they've got safe still here, but two CTs on the other side of the map. Okay, now this will be hard to get in. Late smoke as well. Yes, sir. Worried about that mid-construction push. It has been a consistency from EG. Shot landed. Ooh, not that one. Uh -oh. Safe's taking damage here. Tags down rush ever so slightly. Eight seconds on the clock. Oh, oh the incendiary, though. Oh, he's got a smoke on it. In the smoke, so it's all good. They've got themselves the post plant. Oh, they got a flank coming. Yeah, that Maybe should be aware the of this. Of this. He's watching it from quad, but... They just feel so suffocated in this backside. No real cover to play around from. Yuri should be able to clean up at least one, if not both. Rush. One kill on the round. They've lost track of him, but once the smoke fades... Yeah, it's tough. He has to take a fight. Mm -hmm. He's got to get one before the smoke goes down. And now that it has run out, he sections them off beautifully. Gets back into the cover. Rush, this would be a huge clutch to tie up this game at four. Buying time wonderfully as well. <laughs> Rush, Let's a go, master class in just dodging death. And he doesn't dish it out, <laughs> but he wins it. That's well done, man. That's, that's a really hard clutch to win. Walco again Ooh, on his pass the one way. It's a start. Oh, but I don't think he's gonna. Oh, he hit Heard him. That. Oh, and Safe tries to run from it. Art has his back. Yeah, good cover there from Art, making sure that Walco can't capitalize. Now that's gonna just transition EG to the B commit. Drop fights around Tetris. Clean couple of kills. Case Serato, oh, yeah. killer coverage, and a rock solid defense from Furia. This sort of hold. Whoa. <laughs> Slide. Excellent flash as well, man. Art, blind as a bat. Elevator spam, though. That will finish off Hex. Rush is desperate to try and get the entry here, but Serato will find the, the timing to turn back around. And again, it is just Furia stopping everything all at once. Mm. But pretty frantic. Look at the radar real quick, folks. We had the kill through Elevator, the deep one on Rush, in construction, and then the original hold from Serato. So the Who's attack was, was multifaceted. Whose strat was that? The one that went through spawn? Was it Ence or... I don't know. They copy that from. I can't remember who that was. It was Evil Genius. Might have been Furious, honestly. <laughs> okay, that'd be, that'd be dirty. Let the Raptor spawn to go B. Junior, he's gonna get spotted. Yeah, yeah right. I peek here from Yuri. Walco, final chance to shine on this T side. Gets dinked though. Won't make his moment any easier. Does get a little nade damage in, so that's something to work with. But at 15 seconds, Junior in a highly unlikely 1v4. Still an excellent half out of Evil Geniuses. With Safe tucks it in. And another smoke goes down. So the old 5v5 pistol retake, huh? The old cowboy shoot him up. Now when Junior Smoke goes out, that's when this retake attempt goes on. But I don't think they know where the plant is, actually. Oh, they shouldn't. He's also the kit carrier. So looking like Fury are just going to sweep away second pistol. Some swift headshots as the retake attempt begins. Flank finds its timing. Walco's got himself a double. He's also got Junior to try and work with, but he gets swarmed. Walco, three kills. Bomb's going to claim his life as Furia claim their seventh round. Mm, yeah, so they waste too much ammo on one kill. So let's see how sharp he's looking right now. Quad's a good spot for a multi. Now, what he would like is some flash support. And again, no re-clear. He's got a smoke too if the molly lands on oh, him. Oh, Rushy. Nobody's checked it. Nobody's checked it. Seven seconds and Rush again is going to play this pillar to perfection. No time. No I time. don't think so. Plants at three, and the nade denies it nonetheless. Woo! EG, rotate in. Will they walk away with guns? Fight Furia with ferociousness. Let's see if EG kick it up a notch. Because right now, it's been that Furia T side. But remember who won the last round. Rush. Ooh, baited in. Mm. Hexed shows a little skin. Naughty. And the opper picks up the kill. It's at the cost of a lot of health for the two players involved with that opening pick, but a 5v4 is there nonetheless. Case Serato traded out by Walco. Can't get the... Oh, excuse me. Case Serato survives. Yeah, it looks deep like dead that. instead. And say... Oh. Junior didn't want to go slow on that angle. Obviously could have had the advantage, but... You know. 
The danger was imminent with the lost sight. Molly for the bomb sight. They're just waiting for that construction jump. George and Hexed. One smoke between the two. Kit on George. That smoke tells them there's somebody back down at the bottom of stairs and losing George that quickly makes Hexed's situation all the more desperate. He just wants to get away. And they're not going to let that happen. They gun him down. Furia back into the lead here. A one-off CT round win from EG. Ooh! We did ask, right, like how many new things would they have in store for us? Well, that's not quite new, but it's still something different. And Junior uh, should have gotten that kill. Yuri somehow survives it, drop not so lucky. 5v3 in this explosive ramp hit from Furia that EG managed to contain. Oh yeah, he lined up that molly really well as for being smoke blind too. No HEs to lodge him out. Whoa, safe? Okay, that shot looked good too. Yeah, these ops are broken. Curved barrels. Nice pressure here from EG. Over top the smoke. Starts off with Junior giving away for George to rotate in. Maintaining his life. Keeping that smoke up. Getting an extra shot off. Getting a kill and damage earlier on. Careful though. This is a case Serato that has oh. very much reclaimed his score. Ooh, and could have had Hex not traded that one quick. Has to get one. Finished off Junior, 6 HP. And Junior's still up. There's full kits of utility, but the top site is not going to get anything but flashed. So that's something to keep an eye on. Oh my god, what a spam. Last bullets in the magazine. That's going to bolster the confidence before they commit to this hit. And George is up on a pedestal right now. Junior oh, late smoke. loses his angle. George's position, good for one. There's the trade back from Yuri, and Rush fell behind the smoke. So they end up losing Hex to the wall bank and George to the split. Those are the two pieces left in front of that wall of smokes that we were praising them for fighting in front of. Junior lost his line of sight, and Rush didn't feel confident enough to stick around, didn't want to run that risk of dying alongside George. Here's the so smoke. Retake, here we go. I think. Oh, no. Flash. Flash. Safe's fine. Holds his angle. Walco touches bomb. That's going to get the first peek up and around the corner right into Junior's scope. Ooh, slick move. And now those M4s start to press out. Walco doubles back. He's going to be the diffuser, and it all gets denied. Uh, Furia clamped down. Potentially get more. However, safe is on this angle. Does Junior go any farther? He does. Oh, and he gets safe. Falls back quickly. Not just to the corner of box, but all the way deep CT. Fury to again. <laughs> oh, how did Hex die here? Peeking on the short Ooh. side, Art finding Junior's head over top of the smoke, but George is down beneath it. Oh. Oh, presents itself. Just waits. On a silver platter for Art. He paints middle with the heads of evil geniuses. from a 5v4 to a 2v4 mm. as Furia on the brink of 15. Yeah. Defending against A. That's going to be a little bit too tough, I think. How's this Walco flank shaping up, though? Let's so get that plant off. Walco up the ramp. But the hardest of angles being held here from Drop, who comes down low. It leaves Rush now in a 1v4. Op gets saved, but not for long. Uh, oh, oh, never mind. <laughs> Damn. Bada boom. Ouch. Bada bing. Okay. Yuri takes the 15th down. So, nice reaction. So if EG did ever have win conditions, those two have fallen away. But still, you look at that score at the top of your screen. Oh, I think that EG shouldn't be too tough on themselves. The B site has nobody to stop this hit. Furia slide in with bomb. 3v4 retake here to try and keep Vertigo alive with Mirage up next. I haven't seen that map in some time, actually. That's yeah, true. I don't think we've cast it all showdown. Yeah. Not yet, that is. There's a big question as to, you know, with Furia starting on the T side of that map, presumably, as it is their pick, will we get more of this? Or will we get more of what EG offered at the start?
drop Art Caserato, all a part of the close. Furia probably caught maps for sure. So I think no matter how this goes, whether it's explosive in the favor of Furia or there's a chance for EG to put up something competitive, it's going to be very entertaining. Some people's best shots will be hit right now. Well, George is going to open as he teleports between this dimension and another. <laughs> Two sets of bread is here for EG on the B defense. If there's one thing I get out of this game, it would just be a great round for Walco or George to be able to walk away. Did Art just start here? <laughs> yeah. How, when did... Hmm. When did he even go to mid? What the hell? We're rushing B. He's like, yep. <laughs> yep. Me too. <laughs> He's been right. sat here ever since. All right. Russian spawn. Probably doesn't know about Art right now. Like Art's about to go on top. Oh, but he can actually cut off jungle quickly. Oh, but Junior hits a great reflex shot. And the bomb gets planted. You get a snap down there. Can't hold on to it, however, so Furia do in fact slide into that control. Ooh. And George coming out with them dual Berettas. Drops position now revealed. Caserato's not known about until this point where he drops George. Rush. Well, he dies empty-handed, but Hexed in the 1v2 clutch has already dropped one oh. and drop himself. <laughs> Not the flowers again. <laughs> Here comes the full commit. Look, down on the bomb site and safe over smoke. So George has got a lot to deal with. And drop will be the end of him. Now all of a sudden the CTs can't really even exit out from market. So because of the way that goes so quickly, Walco, tough job here, man. Ooh, Just actually maybe not. Yeah, being sent in to go see what if it was open. Yeah, because they're flanking B oh, as well. George, uh oh, George, George of the B app. Oh, flashback around for the side peak. Oh yeah, they eat it. Excellent flash. That stalls them, allows Junior to pluck Art off the front side. Oh, they they still think he's further back because this is George. George All isn't renting. He's owning George. Collection of a B split, that's for sure. Some pressure on Walco, whether he sees it or not. Ooh, what a sh that's a stage shot. Oh my god. Now George is in a world of hurt, or soon to be, unless he goes above and beyond, knowing multiple players are running at him from that exit. Tough place to be in. Safe. That snapshot to the left side of sight. Not even was a wall bang. Like, brutal. Wow. The drop gets tagged up, and he only has that deagle to work with. Even though the health is so low fear for EG. Mm. Feels like maybe you just let this one go, unless Hexed's flanked can find a freebie. Yeah, I guess they wait for that to see how it goes and then decide if they're going to save. Serve up a distraction from Market and hope Hexed hits his timing. Oh, maybe, maybe. Was looking good. Sure enough. Now all of a sudden, attention turned. You can utilize that smoke, a missed shot. They need to find drop. 11 HP on him, but one shot per player would have done it. They jump As this on next smoke comes up. If EG just sweep away these players, Safe shouldn't be able to get into the mix. Drop connects, so does Yuri. Clean Tech 9 shots. There's the mid flank out with the Deagle. And all of a sudden, it's Junior. Not gonna chance this one. Evil Geniuses slipping up a little bit. Uh, they leave that A site empty, and Furia just find the perk. Uh, oh. Sees the feet. Yeah. <laughs> they know there's two there. Oh, coming back at this? Really? Oh, yeah, it's kind of what it felt like was going to happen. And then Art keeps it clean. George's off angle, not going to be enough. It's going to take something special from Junior or from Hexed. And right now, Furia could slow everything down. Art's in the window. Oh, Junior finds him with his head turned. Yeah, he's making big moves there. Drop a stiff breeze away from death if Hexed... Oh, man, wow. if he just throws a nade on drop, it's over. Clean headshot onto safe. Primes this one perfectly for EG 10-2. We talked about leads on that first map in Vertigo, and that was supposed to be shocking news. 10-2 on the horizon. Junior getting burned out of his initial position. Drop kind of timid to take this peak because he only has 15 health and Junior doesn't bite on the bait. Not to say it's Furious fault. It might have just been a total mixed match of personalities and whatever, but... All right, there's another Caserato death instantly inside of the halls. Going A looks a lot more... Lost less appealing, excuse me. Tucked along the wall, they know about wall. 
Falco, but they didn't know about George. Wow. And with fire in front of him, he just skates around it. Hex pops Vent with two T's on the other side of this. Yeah, that'll catch him off guard, but Junior's here to pick up slack. Art not able to cross back over. Bomb's still down in the dirt of the A site, and Yuri 1v4. <laughs> like sitting back and Fury are making enormous mistakes into them. No. Like they're just playing active, meeting Furia pretty much in their zone. George, 20 kills. Junior, 17 and 3. Hex not far off behind them. It seems so doable. Uh oh. And yet Furia will fight tooth and nail to make sure that this doesn't go down easy. So okay. there's the second pistol picked up for Furia. I actually like how they did that, but yeah, still safe has the right idea about it ending B. And they've got cat control under lock here with Caserato, so he's got more angles open to himself. The drop just below. Nice shot. Ready for that one. MP9 down beneath the window. Rock solid defense here from the sniper. Caserato will clean up George towards mid, so Junior just has to tuck tail and let this one slide through. That's five to Furia. Yeah, that was a very good setup. I think they just, they didn't even think about it as a gamble. They still had five alive, so they kept two on A, just leaned a little bit towards B. Wouldn't call that a gamble stack, and they were right that uh, EG were going to go back to it. I mean, every little bit matters in this situation, considering the scoreline. So, Yuri's hold's not immaculate. Things could get sketchy. Even if they're just pistols. Good okay. cleanup. Good cleanup indeed. Even regardless of if Evil Geniuses don't win this, they are not able to convert a two versus three at the moment. It's still just at least a reminder that you can get opening advantages in these rounds. Yeah. And you've got real rifle rounds just around the corner. Yuri's still sectioned off with that bomb. They've got Art pinned behind Ticket. Yuri's going to come back to try and take some pressure off. Art actually dies. And now if Yuri's dropped, well, that bomb can be picked right back up. Oh my Walco God. kills are few and far between. But this one would mean so much. And he's got Kevlar, and he has to cross. Oh. And he gets half of Serato down. And it's definitely on display now. Pistols back up. Yo, safe. Oh, that's a knockdown. Wow, wow, hold on. With CT control. Win condition given over George is on the off, and he has Kevlar, right? They came into this with Kevlar and pistols, and it's just a quick pop. We saw something very similar go the way of Furia on one of their very few T rounds. Well, evil geniuses only need that very same few, and George, with a feud to Serato, comes back, kills Yuri. George on a tear with that picked up op. And Art with drop, see no opening for this retake. Evil geniuses have smashed their way into an A site. That's 14. And it was Walco's entry into two George kills. Is that right? Yes, sir. Holy. The Walco P250 triples. Blast. Wow. Bang. Wall bang. It deserves a nickname. Pop. Shebang. Hex is going to run right into the AWP, the first victim of round 22. Window peak unpunished. George trying to catch the head of Serato. Has to dodge Flash. Junior picks up the slack over from Chair. But there's a double op here from Furia. Could catch EG off guard. Rush is going to slide out from Ram. And there it is. Art still staying mobile on that AWP. And Rush doesn't want to let his guard down. Doesn't believe that site is empty. Little move there from Yuri, but Rush has effectively slid between two CTs. Oh, Junior doesn't have any utility. He could do, oh, and Yuri will eventually suss him out, nice. just in case. He's feeling it. And 15 S seconds left. Sensing some sort of proximity. Well timed. Oh, a oh, little short. There it is, the molly. Too short. Molly on Yuri. He has no Rush finds him out from oh Palace. Junior picks Caserato deep ticket. Hex has no pressure to get into this fight. He can just sit back. And even then, he decides to take it to them. A flawless one from EG. Wow, they got With smoke. bomb ticking already. A smoke to try and cover that exit. Rush is going to play the AK close. He takes Safe's head clean off. And the best thing to happen to evil geniuses since they took down Heroic at the start of the year is at least one map win versus Furia here tonight. And this map win is EG Black.
who can transition into this third and keep up that consistency. Beretta's find Hex first. It's a slaughter so far. George and Walco, all that are left over. And Walco's going to be preoccupied with trying to deal with any kind of rotate through CT. He doesn't get it immediately, so he's a little more worried about the flank. George is given a chance to leave, but that corner position does get cleared. And then the Berettas fit library, arch side. That's where the next wave comes from. And as he drops down, there's the contact. Safe's going to keep him at... I don't know all the rules, but I say give it to EG Black. Contact, top banana. Met by smoke. Hex just kind of puffs his chest. That's going to keep two dedicated to the B site. So worth at least a bit of contact. He grabs bomb while the op has remained posted. Walco's been stuck in arch, just sitting. Or excuse me, that's Rush. Safe. Stutters for a second. Takes the second shot. Down goes George. Yuri keeping his head down. Flash comes over. Junior finds the response, and they know that Safe's in pit, so that bomb plant can't be stopped. Again, playing down to the clock. Something we saw a lot on Vertigo, and something that never really did cost EG a round. Oh, and Junior actually got back up into the halls really quickly. So he could potentially approach the pit. It's going to be hard for Safe to read this. It might give him a chance. I like this move from Junior. Keeping an eye behind him as well. Still that pit player wiggling, squirming, and oh. Safe will get traded. Now Junior's got two fixating in on him, and Art with the wall bang. Wow. Oh, that's kind of nasty. That, that, that's so well played. It's just that they let, he let Safe get the kill on so sight. It's going to be a god flash, I assume. X now hits. Finished off by Art and Safe. Not able to hold off on everything, but still good amount of impact out of him alone. But if he can just get that initial headshot on Art, maybe continuation spray. A little stutter on the corner. Junior locked in behind Orange. Bomb now ticking quick. 2v2. And Caserato finishes him off. George got that back corner. Gets the Caserato kill. And he has, with time, picked up EG's first. Oh, yeah. And that gun will not be saved. Yuri dies with it. Well but done. There is a legitimate chance to run into a stack. Nice flash out of drop, perfectly timed. And EG, a warning sign as to what's on this bomb site. Yuri, double kill. Here comes Safe, tucking right back into the cover. I'm sure EG feel the pressure now. And drop out of the back site. Denies with a double. There it goes, walking onto the landmine that was the four player A stack. So this one was just. I really believe in that. And Arc is hunting, and he's not ready for that corner. Oh, man. The drop comes through with one trade. Drop going to tuck into Orange. Smoke in front of the site. Caserato burned out. He will find Rush. And a beautiful second wow. kill on Walco. Chance to dive into new box, flashing himself for the next round of combat. George is additional victim. Junior. Let's see what he can do. Toppling Caserato to kick off the 1v3. Yet to grab bomb though. Precious seconds burning off this clock. And Yuri within that distance to just sprint down on the first bomb plant. He commits using the fountain for cover. And Yuri's given him a chance here now. All of a sudden, Junior falls back with the shot now versus safe. He's got it all. Talk Junior. Hex is still holding it. I don't know. It just they feels can't like, really tell what's a fake it and what's feels like not, he's, you know? He's just walking through the woods, and I know where all the bear traps are. Right, right, right. <laughs> and it's like, you're about to lose a limb or two. Oh, well, here's that flank set up. No one's watching it for the meantime. Clean MP9 nice kill from Art. Good response from Junior in order to turn, but another fast flank. Not with one, two, but three. And so Hex gets caught off entirely. We get Junior with the kill to Yuri. He is saving them frag after frag, but another clutch is needed in case Serato gets into the close right corner. What a quick scope from Junior. Wow, the patience, the composure right there. Junior now up against safe once again. Junior was dominant on Mirage, barely died ever. And now he is set for the back-to-back -back clutch, this time versus safe on a measly deagle. Junior. Honing in, it is perfect. Back to back. Critics ready to pounce on Furia at a moment's notice. Yuri safe, two kills here for the defense. And Caserato tries to press out, but that flashbang blinds Walco for far too long. And Caserato is able to recover the situation. Here is George now, 1v4, bomb ahead of him. 
sets on fire. And as the smoke plumes, it's dangerous to even try to reach for that. Waiting until now to grab back the bomb. Apartments wrapped from art. Library player stays tucked. Look at the respect they're giving him. He will get this. Oh, no. Nope. Apartments player. He'll come through. Art finds it. He's auto concerned about Arch. That immediately allows evil geniuses to just swing the pendulum back onto short. Safe won't miss his chance. And there's more where the first one comes from, but he can't track the flying player out from Bout oh. X, the drive by. And now Hexton Jr., 2v2. That was Hex, right? Who just slid by on skates. <laughs> yes. Air strafe down into the pit. Completely messes with Safe's tracking. And now Junior paws on an M4. Hexed, armored off. Nade misses its intended target. We've got a kick here on Art, but Drop gets blindsided. Now Art's fixated on him, and we're going to have Hex just holding an angle. Surely Junior gets aggressive, and EG get nasty. Oh, four other players have, barring Junior. I think EG got to be happy with five. Oh. Maybe six. <laughs> Hex decides to come through with the double Mac 10. They can pounce on that B site, safe the closest rotate, smoke down on cross, and a deep one here from Hex. He gives up the angle, but he just heard that Molotov tick. So insta headshot. Three kills from him. And watch Junior queue up the last two. Off turns back around, and this kid don't I'm miss. For Yuri has definitely woken up here. Case Rado consistent as per. And okay. See what happens. Hex. Well, he made some rounds happen. This time he'll go down first in the halls. Junior, he gets a little, but it's not enough. And that mid flank. The majority of the CTs all just chopped down by K Serato. The Glock tears through all. No problem for him. Okay. Junior hit that. Well. Oh. Oh, <laughs> the alley you. <laughs> Sick. No further help needed. George. At risk of getting opt, of course. Mm -hmm. First player swings out wide. Doesn't get the incendiary down fast enough. They know he's in the corner. Wow. He's going to fight. And at least the fire holds it back for he, a second. He created the timing. Like, they can't actually just run into B now. So he slowed him down a little bit. They set up behind him. Nading the cross with spam. Bah, safe catches Walco on the flank. Rush trying to maximize the chance of taking a player down through smoke. Here comes Junior. But I mean, this is the Caserato Yuri show. 21 11, 26 11. Hoping to catch somebody back sight, not the case. It's double close on Little Pit. Safe back on Banana holds the angle. Now, Time. the smoke for the exit. Oh! oh. <laughs> Rush gets both. There's still time. Wait, oh there my is. god, there's time. If Rush can get on the defuse with that flash, if all of a sudden Junior locks him in, Rush needs to be the defuser. If he gets it, no way! No oh, way, Rush. Rush with the double fadeaway! Oh, wow. dunked on. Bad molly out of Caserato. They have to smoke their own he molly, and he dies in his own molly. This is starting to shift. And There's George can even juggle. <laughs> what can't this team do? There's nothing on this, right? AK Galil up short. Hex has got his position. That Molly won't get him this time, right? T smoke off the pit. Hex decides to just evacuate. Insta headshot out of rush. Yeah, I love that from I love that from Hex. And honestly, one thing when he was playing on the main lineup that I, I loved is that even though he had a lot of deaths in oh, his... he's got behind Yuri. He doesn't play it too soon, and there's nobody here to trade Yuri. Hex, the perfect timing, and then Rush with a chance to shine. Headshots drop 5v3 off the back of that, and Furia cannot buy an opening. They've got smokes blanketing the site both sides. Hexed inside the trusty pit. Art looks to press through it. Could go over top the moto. But then he gets attacked. Walco comes out of Arch at the perfect moment. 20 seconds, 2v5. And they are being led to the entirety of Evil Geniuses. Five players smoke. Seven cents. What an interesting adjustment to the setup. 
George behind sandbags oh goes God, unchecked. Clear him. Goes unchecked and Art gets killed. Two kills out of George. Now he puts down the smoke, gets spammed through it by safe. No overcommitment so far from EG, but when you take down George, it's Walco up next. They know that. Side of the smoke, hiding in dark. Yuri up top, catches him on the cross as he jumps. And then Walco taken down by drop. An ambitious shot that finds no contact. Bomb pick back up. It despise time for that rotate to come over and reliable pieces in Rush and Hex. Safe attempts to go deep. Hex catches drop and Hex gets both. Tied game, 13 all. 13 all, EG. Heard that movement though, of course. Here it comes, George. Oh my god. Taking shots through smoke, but it goes both ways. And then they press out through CT. Hexed, smoked and spawned because Furia threw one so deep that it blocks off his vision. Look at this wrap around construction, but they forgot about Walco. And he gets himself a double. He's back behind new box. I take it back. This is his chance to shine. Yuri kills his rotate, but he's still locked in. And it falls on K Serato with seven seconds left. Or EG, sure enough, oh, oh. a 14 round lead. Start banking down Banana. On this low buy, they run through. No opener. Ooh, dink on Walco though. Still some damage out. George, guns empty. And drop. Gonna lock him into the corner there, so. A little wiggle room to try and push forward with smokes on both ends. And Walco, do you want to risk this? Low health already as they enable the boost. But now he's got support coming over and evil geniuses. A mere 65 HP away from 15 on the scoreboard map three. And their one little lurk of the round that they tried to pull off through bracket got opt down by Junior. It's not even an option for them. Drop and safe, low HP. How quickly do they come through? They're gonna give it their best shot. Oh! Bomb drop, That's, no chance. Wow, yeah, drop down to 2 HP. This, this is, is for it. Series point here. 15. Wow. The angle, George inside the site. If he can't get it in banana, can he grab it from the bomb site? Fire on his feet, takes half his health off. And here they come, climbing over top. He still snaps it up into drop. Not able to get a second though. Junior worried about both sides as Rush immediately plays this up on the banana flank. Art doesn't hear it coming. And so we're back to the 3v3. A minute as things slow down. Oh my god. So close through smoke, nearly denies them again. But here comes Serato, a challenge that he loses, and it falls onto Yuri. All that's left, EG, pull off the impossible. <laughs> they made it happen, they beat Furia. They In locked the up the series. The b string team for EG have the world's attention now. The team that we had no idea what to do.